Hola a todos, aquí Tori22, 680, continuamos con The Witcher 3 y eh, seguimos con la misión de Flores Rotas. Vamos a conocer a aquella chica que le gusta tanto a nuestro amigo Yasquera, Dan de León. Después de esto, eh, el próximo capítulo es muy probable que sea el tema de la rima con la nobleza que vimos en el anterior. Vamos a ver qué tal se nos da. Eso no hay grado, Martín Pescado. Poco después del ocaso. Vamos a hacer una pequeña meditación. Ah, no puedo hacer eso. Bueno, vamos a salir un momento a ver si me deja. find some arse lists. Should start soon. Your 
scent, berries tall, lilac sweet. To dream of raven locks and twisted stormy. Silence, woman. We'll come to hear music. A murderer? There's a war on. Some die. Oh, please, argue this out elsewhere. Squabbles and rows again. And I was told this was a decent establishment. If I know Geralt, he risked his noggin to save someone else's arse. Save, you say? He murdered folk. Don't let him provoke you. There's the door. Settle this outside. Come. I wish to listen to music. Music? Cultural capital of the world? The fuck it is? Le salvé la vida y eliminé el grifo. Permit me to introduce uh, this year's Prasama. Known also as Calanetta, as lovely as she is talented, and this is Geralt of Rivia. I know. Dandelion's told me a great deal about you, and I've listened with bated breath. Don't be surprised. After all, doubt I could think of a more fitting subject for a ballad than a witch's love for a sorceress, or should I say, sorceresses? Ha 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 ha! Seems Dandelion was meticulous in telling my story, down to personal and insignificant details. Did he offer anything about himself, like where he was going? <laughs> Splendid! Very funny, truly. So, see you later. Not here. Come with me. There a reason for all this sneaking around? An excellent one. When last I saw Dandelion, he told me he was planning a heist. Siggy Reuven's vault. Atracado. And I've not seen him since. Reuven, what's he like? Tall, fat, dangerous as hell. Limp in his gait, left leg. Sounds like a lame rock troll. If trolls were devilishly intelligent and had a flair for crime, yeah. I'd agree. Dandelion breaking into a vault. I'd sooner expect him to choose a life of celibacy. True. Forgot to pay for his way into Pasaflora once. Only to wake the next three nights worrying about it. Any idea what got into him? He have debts he needed to pay off? Claimed he was helping someone. Urgent matter that couldn't wait, you said. This someone. Dandelion mentioned their name. No. But if I know Dandelion, it's her name he failed to mention. As he failed to mention her slender waist and ample bosom. Ha 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 ha! Let me guess. Attempted heist was a failure. Well, he's not driven up in a gilded carriage laden with jewels, so I should think so. I've asked after him everywhere. But it seems an army of tongue-stealing cats has overrun the city. I learned only that he raised a ruckus at Horse and Junior's lair. Then Horson's men chased him all over town. Horson Jr. doesn't ring a bell. Biggest prick in Novigrad. Not literally, but... Got it. You're not a fan. But what did he do to you? Try the whole town. He's one of four bosses who control the city's underworld. The others being Siggy Reuven, Carlo the Cleaver Vares, and the King of Beggars. The rascal. At least he didn't cross the church as well. 
Bring that venerable institution into it. We'll be in deep then. Parece que tendré que salvar a Yaskir de nuevo. Here I go again, rushing to Dandelion's rescue. He ought to pay me a salary. Whoever he is, I sincerely doubt he's in the mood for jokes. Nor am I, in fact. Relax, I'll get him out of this. Gotta talk to this Horson first. And Siggy Reuven. Know where I might find them? I don't know about Horson, but Reuven runs a bathhouse. Careful, though. He's a dangerous character. So am I. I don't doubt it. But Dandelion's not. I beg you to hurry up. Let me know as soon as you learn anything. Vale, busca un barco para ir a escribir. No, ve a la casa de baño se habla con sí, Reuben. Priscila es hermosísima, madre mía. Qué besón. Tell me, you and Dandelion, how do you meet? At a poetry tourney in Ellender. Naturally, I'd already heard much about Master Dandelion. And it proved true. At first, I thought him a bloated, narcissistic buffoon. Just at first. Well, only cows don't change their minds. I changed mine when he came to congratulate me. Never expected he could lose so graciously. Dandelion can be irritating, I shan't deny it. Yet, I also know he can be fair and noble at times. Well, I very much doubt I could bear to have him around were it not so. I see. I get it. Vale, pues hasta luego. Hay que ir a la casa de baños. Vamos a ver qué hora es. Eh, son de noche. En busca de bastardo, hijo. Esto es otra misión, por lo tanto... Lo vamos a dejar eh, aquí, en este capítulo. Muy corto. Capítulo en el que hemos escuchado una preciosa canción. Y hemos conocido a Priscila. Y también, madre mía, la que casi marca... Me, me, casi me lía la mujer de Huerto Blanco. Pero es que no lo entiendo si le salvé la vida. Si es que ibas a morir. O sea, no, 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 lo, no lo entiendo. Bueno, vamos a dejar el capítulo aquí. Un placer estar con todos vosotros aquí en 22.380. Nos vemos muy pronto. Hasta luego, gente. Chao.